The Bell Zephyr MIPS helmet might be one of the more expensive options out there but it's well ventilated, fairly low profile, and it boasts an excellent new MIPS integrated fit system. Bell says that by using EPS of two different densities it can custom tune impact management and design a better helmet. The next thing you need to know is that the Zephyr features a MIPS liner integrated into the float fit race retention system. Sorry for the jargon. I'll explain it. The float fit race system is a bit of the helmet you can adjust to change the fit. You get three points of adjustment, a clicky dial at the rear, 22 mm of up, down movement of the cradle at the back of your head, and you can also alter the lateral position of each of the two occipital pads, at the rear, independently, so you can have the pad on the right position further out than the pad on the left. For example, if that better suits the shape of your head. The lighter weight straps sit flat against your face and neck thanks to Bell's Tri Glide dividers. I really like them. Twisted straps are the devil's work. As well as adding to the neatness, Bell says that these improve aerodynamic efficiency, twisted straps add drag, but it doesn't make any overall aero claims for the helmet. The Zephyr certainly provides plenty of ventilation. View the frontal profile of the helmet and the vents take up a king-sized amount of space. The air that comes in is channeled over the top of your head to keep you feeling cool most of the time. This is a very airy helmet.